This is a cortado. It's one of my favorite ways to try a new coffee, and this is how you make one. A cortado involves using one part of espresso to one part milk. And because it's a one-to-one -one ratio, you want to make sure that you're using quality coffee for this, since that's going to be the majority of what you taste. You don't necessarily need to use a really fancy espresso machine, but you should at least be grinding your coffee fresh. Doing a combination of both using fresh beans and grinding your coffee fresh will get you the best tasting cortado possible. This thing right here that looks like a crazy torture device is just a WDT, and this is used to break up the clumps in the coffee to help your espresso extract more evenly. And using a puck screen like this will also help with a more even extraction. What we're looking for is a shot that looks kind of like this. There's no spraying and the stream is dead center. And it has that even layer of crema on top because these beans are super fresh. Next, we'll steam some milk and then here's a tip. If your milk texturing is not on point, you can actually pour the milk into a second pitcher. And a lot of the time, this helps you get a better texture for making artwork. And if you're looking for some fresh beans to make your cortados, check out Coffee Bros.